This case is a sleeve gastrectomy and our first entry is going to be an optical port entry. You keep the gas on low flow because this port has a small hole at the tip of it. That alarm is our fault. It allows us to go through anterior sheath, rectus muscle, and now posterior sheath. And the insufflation is going at a low flow all the time so we don't have to use a varus needle. I think that's in right, good stuff right there. So if you can see from this view, we've just crossed the peritoneum, and this little hole allows us to do insufflation. Can we go to high flow, please, Lindsay? So for this operation, the surgeon stands on the patient's right side. We use a five millimeter trocar and a 15 millimeter trocar. And then we put a liver retractor in a sub xiphoid position by first putting a five millimeter trocar in and getting the space. This patient has a nice small liver, which is not usually the case for patients with obesity. This is the Takahashi maneuver, named for our first fellow, Eileen Takahashi. Provides a little space so that we can get our Nathanson retractor in. Nathanson retractor is shaped like a question mark, but it's atraumatic to the liver. placement of this retractor so that we can see the esophageal hiatus clearly and the angle of hiss. So we elevate up the segment 2-3 portion of the liver and then fix it. This is our orogastric tube that we use as a sizer. 